thanks for stopping by let's dive right in garden sheds and who doesn't need one of these fantastic spaces so what could go possibly go wrong here you've got a steel shed it'll last a very long time it's very economical to purchase quick to assemble it's hard wearing and looks rather well if i do say so in our experience in fusion spray foam down through the years the biggest problems we notice with steel garden sheds in particular and also this applies to storage containers sea cans as some people call them is condensation uh, dripping wet condensation in cold weather oh but you're going to say i've got a, a non-drip layer non-drip layers are effective but not when the temperatures get really cold they work to a certain degree and as you can see in this shed here it has a non-drip layer but the owner of the shed was still complaining about getting drips in cold weather another problem with this uh, particular shed is drafts so this is the second major problem we see is that these buildings tend not to be airtight because of the corrugations in the sheet being particularly difficult to seal where the side sheets meet the roof and where the roof forms into an apex another problem with these buildings is they rattle like crazy in strong winds in particular along the west coast of ireland along coastal areas in general throughout the uk steel buildings tend to be very noisy uh, so if you're spending time in there doing your diy projects these can be very uncomfortable so what's the solution well we propose in this particular building uh, the application of what we call two pound closed cell foam which is similar to the same foam you will see on steel cylinders uh, copper cylinders hot water cylinders once it's spray applied it lasts for life bonds to the surface permanently stops all the rattles deadens the sound from wind noise and gives you fantastic insulation and we absolutely guarantee it will 100% cure uh, condensation we applied a two inch layer to this particular building and the owner was delighted with it so thanks for watching hope you found this informative please subscribe and uh, look out for the next video thanks again bye bye